Oh, what's up guys? Welcome back to RC Overload. Today is going to be awesome. Why is it going to be awesome? Because we get to meet up with my good friend Joe from JPRC and do some crawling up at a place I haven't been before. But first I gotta finish loading up my backpack. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away. To a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away uh. This is what we waited What's up guys? Yes, I am so excited right now I finally get to do something with somebody else <laughs> Um and for those of you that have watched this channel for a long period of time, know that a lot of the filming I do is just from myself. Um, really, it, it comes down to the fact that uh, there's not a lot of people where I live that do RC or that I can meet up with. Sure, there's a lot of people that buy RCs that are locally around here, but no one ever really wants to get together. Real quick, sorry for any background noise um, on the highway at the moment. This truck's not the quietest. <laughs> But, um, so yeah, we are heading up about an hour away to meet up with Joe. Uh, he lives up more near the city. I'm more on the outskirts, out by the ocean. So we get a good hour drive between each other. Uh, but today we're heading up to a place called Blue Hills. And I have never been there before. I am really excited about it. I've seen a lot of pictures. I've seen some crawling videos of him being there uh, with other people and it's absolutely amazing. I mean, it's gotta be one of the coolest places to go RC rock crawling. So, I brought the Axial SCX-10 II today to whip that around, have some fun, uh, and just honestly enjoy the day, you guys. I don't get to do this that often. A lot of the stuff I do is just locally where I am, and there's not a lot of great crawling places that I would consider great crawling places. So, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be a blast. It always is when me and Joe get together. Uh, usually my buddy Brett's with me, but unfortunately he's still down doing schooling, working on helicopters and stuff for the Coast Guard. Good for you, buddy. <laughs> uh, anyways, yeah, so we're gonna head up there. Got about an hour drive. And then we're gonna go have some fun for a few more hours after that. Woo, it's gonna be awesome. made it not too bad on the traffic could have been better but now we gotta find Joe where is Joe we're here like I said this is Joe from JPRC for those of you guys that don't know him, feel free to check out his YouTube channel I'll put the link down in the description box um, so yeah he brought out his SCX 10 2 so we got dual SCX 10 2s today it's his gear and everything yeah, but we have a lot of fun up in the trail today yeah and you this said there's like two different trails one's like a regular walking one's more crawling and stuff yeah so like the first five ten minutes it's just tree roots but once we get there there'll be a lot of rocks it's like straight up rocks you can take different styles nice. and if you tumble you're tumbling back all the way back <laughs> you've seen my uh, other videos they're not going to there could be some damage reports today yeah. absolutely but joe surprised me with a little gift today you guys take a look at his scx 10 too he's got these wheel uh 3d printed wheel well covers right he showed up with some for me. 
You know I'm gonna make a video on this, absolutely. Yeah, because you needed that for the scale. You don't see through from the window well. Right. Yeah. I know, because you guys have all been telling me I need to get an interior on my SE Extend 2, which I'm working on that. <laughs> uh, all right, so we're gonna hit the bathrooms first and then. Yeah, it's on the way up. Cool. Let's go do this. All right, let's have fun. Let's do it. Let's Yay. Do it. <laughs> All right, so we are just about to hit the big part here. If you guys take a look, it's all rocks up there. It's gonna be awesome. See what we can do. Now, Joe, you've hit this stuff before, right? Yeah, I have. What's, uh, what, what should we expect? Uh, just try not to tumble. See that big piece of rock right there? We should be all right. Uh, what could go wrong, right? <laughs> Famous last words. If I tumble, I'll find my truck somewhere down there. Yeah, yeah, that works. This, <laughs> this is going to get interesting. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Oh, holy okay. All right, hold on. I gotta get. I gotta get the camera for this. I'll just stay here just in case it tumbles. All right, my camera is perfectly level to give you guys the idea of the incline here going up as best as I can. All right, Joe, why don't you, uh, why don't you give it a shot here? Let me give it a tumble. Oh, 
foams. So, it's definitely been interesting to watch. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, that, okay. That is getting. Holy shit. Dude, you just did it. You just did it. High five that. Boom. Already failing. That's, that's like 80 degree, almost vertical. Ugh. I think that little way up front with the cheating helped. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah, let's fix the body a little bit. It's pinched in. Oh, it's a good thing it's plastic. Yeah, so the difference is I, I'm cheating a little bit. I added more weight under the bumper. You running stock shocks? Yeah. Yeah, okay. 30-30. I do not like that approach. Oh, nice driving. Yeah. You backing up to save it. Um, all right. You think I can do it at least this way? Yeah. Okay. Just, is your heart racing yet? So you go up, you go up to the right, not that way. So take that. Yeah. That? Yeah. Right, right there. I think you can get it up right there. All right. I'm going to come down just in case it does drop. And then you can oh, take a left up. I just moved for yeah. I didn't realize you had a... Yeah, you should make it up there, no problem. Yeah. Well, is that too steep? Is it going to go? That's why I'm standing down here. Yeah. <laughs> Did you build that? Yeah. Nice. Go, go, go. Yeah, there you go. Good job, man. Good job, man. Awesome. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, that, you know what? It, it's funny because well yeah, no, that's fine. They're just RC cars, but yeah, it's exhilarating. Challenge yourself to see how far you can push your truck, and that is the most I have done. Okay, so while shooting some B-roll, taking some pictures of the trucks and everything, and just kind of enjoying this view, which, by the way, check this out. Oh, going crooked there. <laughs> that, that is incredible. I have nothing like this where I live. I mean, granted, this is only an hour away from me. I am still crooked. <laughs> uh, it, it's absolutely insane here. And seriously, Joe, thank you for taking me here. This is incredible. Look at that rock wall. Joe's trying to like conquer this thing and it's just not working out, but he did break something. It's pretty funny looking. <laughs> oh, that's, that's yeah, awesome. Nothing major. Uh, we just popped the pan hard bar. So I may need a new, new ball or just a new rod end. But I can pop it back in right now and uh, keep going with it. There we go. All right, let me just do it right away. All right, so we just had our had a little break up here, sitting up on the mountain. It's been like wait, an hour. Hillside. To get here? Yeah, I think about an hour so far. Yeah, yeah, we've been here for about an hour. I think an hour and a half. Cause what we got, I got up here right a little, a little before ten. Yeah. We took off shortly after that, right and it's like twelve now. So actually two hours roughly. Oh yeah, yeah, we hang out here for half an hour. But yeah. Let's get going. We're only halfway up. Yeah, exactly. We're only halfway. Yeah. I'm going to have so much footage, I have no idea what I'm going to do with. So, all right, well, he's back and running. I'm back and running. I had a little mishaps with my winch line, so it's going to look like it's dangling. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Um, but we're going to head up to the summit, which is basically going to overlook everything. And that's, that's where I'm going to end this video. So we've got a lot more to climb. Let's, uh, let's go and enjoy this.
go. A little help. Do that. Do that again. Do that. Again. Staring. <laughs> what? That's that's how you do YouTube, man. Where, where's the trucks? There's the trucks. All right. So. It's reversed. You have to reverse your steering. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that that's totally messing me up here. <laughs> you guys see that? Okay. Oh. I'm actually doing it. Yep, you are. Oh my god! That is so awesome. I hope you guys can see this. I hope I'm getting this all in. Joe just taught me something. Usually, I go like this. My thumb's long enough to be able to steer, so that's how I do it. Check this out. That view. That is absolutely incredible. We're, uh, what, probably 20 minutes away from Boston? Yeah. Boston is that way? Yeah. yeah. Okay. South of Boston. Yeah. So, there's the rest of the world. Hi, guys. <laughs> All right, so we just climbed up to the top of Blue Hills here, uh, Skyline Peak. Uh, there's more we could have done, but it's already like one o'clock. We've been here since 10. We're a little, a little exhausted, a little tired. So we're pretty much finishing it up. How's it going? Don't mind us, we're just doing a YouTube video. <laughs> Looks like some military gear there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, it, it's definitely probably been the coolest scale crawling adventure I've done. Um, seriously, a, an amazing guy to go crawling with. Anybody that lives locally and wants to go crawling with us, just hit us up. We're always willing to take people out. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, so we're going to start descending, heading back. Start editing this for you guys. I'm actually pretty tired, pretty exhausted. You've been here for like, what, four or five hours now? Yeah, 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 because yeah, it's almost two now, right? Yeah, it's getting almost two. Yeah, almost two actually. So it's been awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I will be coming back here more often. I got a whole lot of better ideas for uh, future films and video blogs and stuff to do here with Joe and possibly other people. I'm thinking next time we bring up the Yetis and just bomb up here. It's the high speed section of the trail. You can yeah. Go full blast. Yeah. Yeah. So, all right, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time on the next RC Overload. Don't forget to subscribe to this guy. Link in the description box.